Following a series of airstrikes against Islamic State targets in Syria on Monday evening, Pentagon officials told a briefing on Tuesday that they had hit targets belonging to the Islamic State and Khorasan Islamist groups, while avoiding civilian areas. One witness, however, told reporters that several missiles had hit civilian areas instead of a military installation up in the hills nearby. The US carried out the airstrikes using manned and unmanned air assets, including F-22s, F-16s, F-15s, FA-18s and B-1 bombers. Ships in the Persian Gulf and Red Sea were also employed. The aircraft carrier USS George H.W. Bush is currently in the Persian Gulf, while the guided missile destroyer USS Arleigh Burke is in the Red Sea. The bombing began at approximately 3.30 a.m. on Tuesday, with targets including Islamic State installations in and around the Syrian city of Raqqa. Among the targets were fuel and weapons depots, training sites, troop encampments, as well as the Islamic State headquarters. According to the Syrian Observatory for Human Rights, which monitors conflict in the country, dozens of Islamic State fighters were killed in the airstrikes.